Good looking peeps. This is TJ, broker of Fitness Realty. Um, this is a video that's kind of outside of my norm, um, but it is something that I want to hit on and um, make sure that everybody in our network knows about this. Um, you can see on the background of my screen, there is a crypto.com coin. Um, if you don't know a lot about cryptocurrency, that is okay. Um, I would love to teach a little bit. Um, I'm all about the slow rolling into investments um, and not taking too much risk. And you guys know that I'm, I'm all about that now. I used to be a, a big player that was like, oh, let's just sling money everywhere and lost a lot of money doing that. So um, I like dollar cost averaging approaches now. And so the reason that I'm bringing this one up is there is a way for you guys to kind of get on get on board with something that is going to become mainstream um, and you're going to start seeing a lot of this name everywhere um, you're going to see it a lot more in sports really um, because they're trying to hit a certain demographic with their um, product so this product happens to be something that can bridge the gap right now between um, not knowing about what cryptocurrency is not knowing about how to use it um, not knowing about how to uh, buy it in the first place um, and all of that along with an easy to remember name and an easy to remember uh, process and then an easy um, platform to utilize. And so um, we're all kind of living in this digital currency age now anyways. We're all using our debit cards, credit cards. Um, I was having a discussion with somebody and um, I asked them about their paycheck and when the last time they saw it in hard cash was. Um, and it, it was never, you know, nobody, uh, or not nobody, but very rarely do we see our, our uh, paychecks anymore in cold, hard cash. That's just something that we don't do. Um, and that's just the nature of the beast. It's faster to have it digital. Um, it goes into your account, and then you bill pay some stuff, and you, you don't even see it anyway. So um, we are living in this digital age, and this is going to bring us to... Um, a faster digital age to utilize the processes that are coming around. Anyway, about four years ago, I saw Binance Coin, which is another platform, um, another exchange, and another process that looks very similar to this crypto.com, um, but it wasn't very feasible and it wasn't accessible at the time, and you had to do a, a bunch of like um, VPN number stuff and, and trying to log in from a different country and going around the system which was very difficult and it was hard to use. Um, Crypto.com has solved that for us and made it so that you can get on and anybody can get on and, and start buying Bitcoin or Ethereum or I'm sure you've heard some of these names. Um, if you haven't heard the name of Bitcoin yet, you've been living under a rock. Um, I am not a huge proponent of going hard and, and putting all your money into Bitcoin or anything like that. Um, but I am a proponent that when you see a market start to shift and you start to see things kind of move in a certain way, um, it is a good idea to start getting a little bit of your eggs into a separate basket, right? A little diversification. Um, something I'm going to show here really fast is um, just the market cap. And by market cap, I mean how much money is in Bitcoin. So if you click on Bitcoin right now, um, one Bitcoin is 57,597 at the time of this shooting, um, and which is pretty high, right? Um, a lot of people, if they saw this two years ago, they may have seen Bitcoin at $3,000 or $4,000, and then they thought that was really high. Um, but the thing that I'm trying to point out with this slide, or not this slide, but this website, is this market cap right here. Whoops. Um, it is a market cap of one trillion dollars over one trillion Which is really interesting to me um, if you go to market caps for individual countries um, Bitcoin has enough market cap to be like number 16th in the world in size of dollar amount in country so this just goes to show you that it's growing really rapidly um, the digital age is already upon us and this is just the new age moving forward um, like I said, I'm not a huge proponent of putting all your money here. I just think that you should get a little bit. And then, like I said, crypto.com has solved that issue of the average person being able to get involved. Okay, one more thing I'm going to show here. 
really fast, and, uh, and and we can always talk more about this, but this is the, uh, a holder's kind of printout of how many accounts there are um, in the world right now utilizing Bitcoin or that have Bitcoin on some type of file. <clears throat> you can see this says 30, somewhere around 39,600. Um, this is in terms of millions, I believe. Um, it says it somewhere. Um, where does it say that? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Sorry. Okay, so I'm hovering over this Tuesday, November 30th. There are just over, or not just over, but there's close to 40 million um, holding addresses. So individual addresses with um, any type of Bitcoin in there. It could be 0.001, could be a lot, right? It could be a lot of Bitcoin. But what's interesting here is 39 million, or, or let's call it 40 million. Um, so only 40 million people on the planet know what Bitcoin is and have bought some, um, which is very, very small percentage of the, of the total population that's on the globe. Um, so if I were to say that this is still a great time to put a little bit of money into Bitcoin, it still is. Um, it hasn't reached mainstream adoption yet, and, and maybe it won't. But right now, with a $1 trillion market cap, that's pretty big and pretty bold. All right, let's go back to crypto.com really fast. Mm -hmm. All right, so now we're on crypto.com. The thing that I wanted to show here is amount of holders. So you can see right now, holding addresses, there are 157,620 holding addresses that are unique. Um, you can see the market cap currently is uh, 18 billion, um, which is pretty small, right? But still pretty big in the terms of how many uh, amounts of dollars are in there. Okay, so that's all I wanted to show on, on coin market cap. I just wanted to kind of go over what it looks like to check these things out. Um, as, as always, just text me or call me if you have any questions or comments um, or leave them in the comment section below. I do think it's a good idea to jump on board. I'm going to leave a link down below that's um, a link for you to get $25 in free crypto um, just to join this platform. And um, even if you do nothing but get the $25 and then just leave it and let it grow, let it grow, um, I think that'd be a great idea. There are ways to, to check out the platform and utilize it more effectively. I can show you what those look like. Um, and I'll probably do more videos about this in the future. But for now, let's leave it at that. If you want $25 in free crypto, click on the link that's down in the comments. And I uh, hope you guys have a great day. All right, see ya.